I don't know if the camera's going to pick up all their duking, but it's so cute. Hey, don't walk on me. And don't steal my socks. I'm wearing them. <laughs> With you. Not up for it, huh? They're very talkative today. <laughs> That's funny. I can't play Blanket Monster with the cats because they bite me really hard through the blankets. But if I play with Ren and Cooper, they just barely put their mouths on me. Just barely. Can't hardly feel it. It just kind of feels like a, someone's putting your finger between their fingers. So gentle. Give me. Oh, sorry. I got your nose. Got it. This is how they destroy my bed. I got you. Oh, 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 come here. Wait, no, no, don't escape me. No, no. Got him. Or uh, not. Boy, he is really slippery when he doesn't want to be got. Hey, look, it's red now. Hey, look, there she is. <laughs> I love that baby cat. Yeah, so cute. Uh oh, sneeze. Here comes your brother. He's after you. He's after you. I was hoping they would talk to the camera, but they're not gonna. Did a little bit. Well, I'm not sure if it picked it up. I've been uh, getting him on a voice recorder for a while. Oops. Oh no, we go. Yeah, my bed's not very high, and it's got a little step up. It's only about a foot and a half high. So. You made a mess again. Yes, you did. It's their own food. Um, I was attempting to trick them. I Usually I have cat food in there, because that's where my cat eats. But, uh, yeah, the bowl's for both of them. It's the only thing they can't really knock down. But, um... They always go and eat out of the cat bowl, so I put their own food in the cat bowl. <laughs> and they didn't buy it, apparently. <laughs> they like the cat food, but they can't have it. Uh, the cat shouldn't even really be eating that kind of cat food, but... That's the only thing that doesn't seem to make them sick. It's that Purina hairball. And Purina is really not a good cat food. Let alone a ferret food. They're both obligate carnivores, so... The ferrets are on Wysong. Yes, good food. Wysong, Epigen 90, digestive support. Uh, Cooper needed the digestive support. She did not. So, they're both on it, and it works great for them. So, yay. Little stinkers, but they like cat food, and... They can't have it. Because it makes them have diarrhea <laughs> and fart a lot. It's really bad. Uh, where's that one? I don't know if you can pick it up very well on here. It probably sounds awful, but I've been getting them on the voice recorder duking because they won't do it for the camera very much. Let's see if this works. It's probably going to sound awful. himself looking on there. <laughs> What's she up to? 
Oh, no table. My table. Mine. Nothing is yours when you have ferrets. However, apparently that works better than no. <laughs> when I say mine. I'm so funny. This is really talkative. Talk, 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 talk. I don't know if this is going to pick it up. This one's quiet. All those little movement sounds, they're rolling around on it. And of course, Ren likes to bite Cooper on the tail. She's evil. Cooper's got a little broken tail, he's had it since he was a kid. And it's her favorite thing to bite. Little stinkers. Where'd you go? Hey, you. Oh, I love that. I wonder if anybody else has spirits that talk that much. Mine pretty much never stop unless I'm filming them. <laughs> They walk around and they go at everything. It's so cute. And they do it when they wrestle. They do it when they war dance. <laughs> they just do it all the time. Don't you? Which one of you stinkered? You. Ew. Did you go on my floor? Oh, I bet you did. Maybe she just farted. Sometimes. Sometimes ferrets fart and they are a little stinky for about 10 seconds and then they go away. And since I don't smell it anymore, I think that's it. Every once in a while. It was funny because last week we were playing Blanket Monster like they're doing now except for I was under the blanket with them. <laughs> and they were wrestling around and jumping on me and... Cooper came and sat his little butt on my chest with his back up under my chin and he farted and it almost killed me and Ren flung herself out from under the blanket so hard she fell off the bed. I love it. It's just such a cute, comforting little sound to hear. I love that my ferrets are always happy. Except for they're usually always happy when they get to be on my bed. <laughs> or anybody's bed, for that matter. They do like my bed. And they left. Wait. That's my shoe. I told you you can't have my sock while oh, I'm wearing it. That also means you can't have my shoe. I never did get that filming from under the fish tank. I don't think I can. I don't think there's enough light. I've got a 55-gallon uh, over there, and the stand has cupboards. And the cupboards have no back. So they've got doors on the front, but there's no back on them, which, whatever. I think it's supposed to be up against a wall, but can't do that with the filters on it, so that didn't make any sense to me. Unless you have internal filters. Anyways. And duking. Yay. But, um, Lynn likes to take my socks and towels and pants, and she stored a lot of stuff back behind my chair there. She's got a few things under that where I've got my walkthroughs and stuff, and video game stuff. <laughs> Here, give us a kiss. <laughs> Oh, 
Don't drown her, please. She's gonna get you. She's such a booger. It is so funny how they do that. They <laughs> just sort of matter of factly pick on each other. <laughs> Looky dunked your old face. <laughs> they always do that. They stick their heads under each other's necks when they're eating or drinking or whatever. Oh, well, now you're gonna steal the food and run off and hide it. Just be happy that I know where your hiding place is, or this room would be filled with bugs. And then we'd all be very unhappy creatures. You know, as soon as you go back in your cage, you're gonna lose that, right? Hi. How's it going? This is just your random day with the ferrets. And me, with my... I thought I was coming down with something, but I've had allergies for the last couple of days, and today they really kicked up. And the other reason I knew they were allergies is because Cooper gets them. No, it's Ren. Well, they both get them, but Ren gets them worse. And uh, Cooper was sneezing every once in a while, and then Ren came over. And you probably heard it on the camera earlier. She's sneezing. So. Oh, it usually just lasts for the first half an hour or so that they're awake. That's usually how it is with me, too, and then it goes away. It's every single day for us all. <sighs> Sorry. Anyways. Uh, it's funny that my ferrets are just like me. They get allergies when I get allergies. So we're all allergic to the same thing. But, uh, Ren's already cleared up, and I think Cooper's already. Hi. How's it going, buddy? Are you done sneezing and snotting, too? Can I have the whole stopping now? Because it's terrible. Look at my eyes all swollen and watery and gross. Oh, there. That's lovely. <laughs> Flexible ferrets. How do you guys do that? Huh? Same time of year every year. Oh. Oh. That was really sad. Here. What you up to? Huh? What you up to? We need a bath. Your oils are getting yucky again. But since we've already had a... Actually, now I can't remember if I had to... When was the last time I washed them with soap? Usually I do oatmeal soaks. And, but, you know, you wash them around and massage their backs and stuff. If they'll actually sit in there and let you. And it gets oil off. Hey, that's my sock. Mine. <laughs> He tries to be really careful not to get you, but they've got sharp little teeth. Ah, oh, you! <laughs> Bullshit. <laughs> Licking my leg. And they have a softer tongue than a cat, but still, it's a little bit rougher than, like, say, a dog's. What are you doing? You need a bath, too. Yeah. Well, you don't look as bad as he does. She's not all gross. She's just got that itch she can't reach. Right there. Don't you hate that? In case any of you are wondering why sometimes your ferrets just scratch and scratch and scratch and scratch and scratch. Sometimes they get an itch right between their shoulders and they can't reach it. And you are butthead. So I've got all this stuff up here that they can't have. But, uh, what? I wasn't gonna fling you. <laughs> He's like, you usually just drop me on the bed. <laughs> Mine. 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 I'm telling you, it's mine. Now it's mine. Right. Yeah, that's the cat bed down there. I just gotta drop my box of sodas on there. They love to play in the box of sodas. Yeah, you think you're slick. And he'll obsess over this for hours <laughs> trying to get up there. See all the boxes? Go play in the boxes. Where did I put their tunnel toy? I've got a, a couple of tunnel toys. No! <laughs> no. I mean it. No. Oh, firmness. <laughs> I can't be mad at him for it. He makes huge messes sometimes because I'll have a soda sitting there sometimes. In fact, oh, 
I was wondering which one was the full one. I had two empty cans over here. They knocked one down. Don't you dare. Mine. <laughs> I'm telling you, it's mine. I'm gonna get him. Ugh. Mine. I know, you're so cute. Oh, this video is gonna be so long. YouTube's probably not gonna let me put it up on there. It's just us goofing around. Every morning, same thing. Sometimes we get lots and lots of cuddles. Uh-uh. You go in your litter box. Just because you're mad at me does not mean you get a poop on my floor. Nope. There's your box. Go in there and use it. Ha. Oh, that one's in too. Hold on.